Okay, here's an example of uh, a single mold that happens to be a sphere, two and a half inch sphere. And then here's a B49 mold set uh, on the extraction plate with posts. Here's the elements here. I'm gonna show you first how the sphere works. So the way, uh, if you look, there's this separate piece that comes out and that's the bottom. That slides, see how it's loose? So if you turn it upside down, it's just gonna fall out. But you put your mix in there uh, on the B3, this upper would attach to the part that goes up and down. It goes down in here and, and compresses the ingredients and retracts on the machine. And then you have your pressed bath bomb in here. So then to get it out, you set it on here. Then you're able to grab this. What I do is grab it with two fingers and kind of hold the top of the sphere with a finger and then set it out on a tray. Add more mix, put it in machine, press it, and it's just that process and repeat, okay? So for a sphere, you can't really grab the top, I have found, and get it out. You grab the element and just set it on a tray like that. So in contrast, on a, uh, a tablet or a cube or something where it's flat on the bottom and flat on the top and you can just grab the sides, um, you don't need the element itself sticking up that high. You can just grab the bath bomb. So for this set, you would have your mix uh, filling in here and it'd be pressed. And then here's an example of the posts and these are all custom height for each set. And you'd set it on here and then you'd have, you know, 12 stars that you'd quickly pick off, refill this with mix and press it in the B49.